These are Southern Plains bison that for thousands of years have roamed this area. My name is Donald Beard. I'm the park superintendent here at Caprock Canyon State Park. It's almost 14,000 acres of some of the most rugged, beautiful canyon lands in the state of Texas. The light just does amazing things in here. We're the home of the official state of Texas bison herd. These bison have unique genetic markers not found in any other bison in the world. They are an important, crucially, vitally important part of the conservation of the species of bison. It is a part of Texas history that must not be lost. My name is Wyman Menzer, and I'm a professional photographer. Jay Wright Moore, when he talked about coming up in this region and, the, and, and just seeing a herd of buffalo, you know, uh, 10 miles deep and 110 miles wide. And it's just, it just, it just amazes me to think that this country could, could support that many, that many creatures. The Great Kill occurred really in 1877 when they said like over a million bison were killed in Texas. Each buffalo hunter killing uh, hundreds of buffalo in a matter of days. It was here on the J.A. Ranch in the late 1870s when, when Charles Goodnight and his wife Mary established the, the buffalo herd that is today is on Caprock Canyon State Park. She saw the slaughter occurring, felt for the bison, saw the little calves, and just decided, you know, I'm gonna save some of them. What we have done is we've allowed the animals to come into their new pasture. We are restoring an indigenous wildlife to its native habitat. The genetic pool of Southern Plains bison will roam the old trails of the millions before them. And I'm very thankful for that. This is its, its, its historic home, is we're fulfilling Marianne Goodnight's vision. With the dust, with the light, even though I'm viewing a herd of 75 or 80 through a lens, I'm thinking of 10,000. Because of the long-term view of people like Charles Goodnight and Marianne Goodnight, the J.A. Ranch, Texas Parks and Wildlife, we still have these wonderful beasts among us. These animals belong to the state of Texas. They're your animals. It's a great opportunity to come view the last of their kind as we try to do our best to expand their range and grow the herd.